So I mentioned overlay, and overlay is essentially a, another uh, another way of implementing the same functionality uh, that we just saw. So it's a mechanism for creating you know, floating panels on the screen. An interstitial would be a good example. Uh, things like modal dialogues or any sort of you know global app level uh, notifications. Um, things that may fall outside of, of the normal flow or the normal structure of the app. So in this case, um, uh, the CDK provides a number of positioning strategies. So we can use the global position strategy for something that has a specific position in the, in the viewport um, outside of other elements. So things like the little dialogue and the snack bar. Um, connected position strategy would enable positioning re relative to some anchor element. So this would be handy for things like tooltips, um, menus, if you have, say, a trigger on an element, you want to display um, a list that is anchored uh, to the trigger, etc. And then uh, there's also a position strategy interface. So if you have some sort of custom strategy, um, you would be able to implement this this interface and define your own strategy. Um, similarly, we can handle how the component scrolls or handle scrolling. So there are a number of um, strategies to do that. One is the, the no op, which, which is just the default. Um, it does nothing. The uh, close scroll strategy will, will close the overlay on scroll. So if you scroll, if you scroll outside of the element, you can automatically close. Uh, so if you had some sort of pop-up and you want to make that disappear when the user starts to move down the screen. Um, we have the block scroll strategy. So this will prevent scrolling when the overlay is open. So if you have a dialogue and you want to prevent the uh, content behind the, uh, behind the screen, um, you can use the block scroll. scroll. And again, there is a I'm oh, sorry, there's a reposition. So this will uh, move or reposition the overlay element on the scroll. Uh, they do note in the documentation that this um, can protect, potentially impact scroll performance. So keep that in mind um, if, you're, if you intend to uh, reposition the element. And then finally, there is um, uh, an interface for implementing any type of uh, custom 